we set up a farm partnership two years ago now because luckily a block of adjoining land came up for sale beside us and it was a very big commitment in buying that block of land so we felt the farm partnership was probably the best option for us and um, it showed commitment to the business from myself and my father and along with a number of other benefits of the farm partnership such as tax uh, benefits um, young farmer top-up scheme and um, stock relief well i think it also it, it 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 was a big in terms of the banks it was easier to talk to the banks as well because uh, it showed great commitment for both of us uh, and plus as well too i've been farming a long time and i was anxious to step into the back seat we wanted to get this project off the ground uh, and it needed both of us for the first couple of years but ultimately too it was about a transition stage of course i would step into the background and uh, alan would become the senior partner in the business there's a lot of excellent advice and support for us setting up our farm partnership. Um, I suppose really our accountant was, was very helpful, our solicitor too, um, the Department of Agriculture and along with our tax advisor, he was very helpful in, in the setting up of the, of the farm partnership. Um, yeah, well, decision making is a, is a joint process. One person can't go ahead and do something if he feels like it. Um, that's probably the main benefit of the partnership is ideas have to be discussed and you can't go ahead and do something until you both agree upon the idea. Uh, we expanded our farm quite rapidly in, in the last two years. We went from 175 cows before the quotas went to 250 cows now. We hope to milk 270 cows next year. So there's a big equipment in workload, but the whole workload is sort of a, a joint shared process. Uh, our roles have sort of evolved. Uh, we don't tend to segre actually segregate such. It depends what has to be done each day. Uh, Alan now tends to do more of the fertilizer work. I tend to do more of the uh, slurry spreading. Alan has taken over more of the silage making operation now at this stage. So it is evolving and it is evolving well for us. Uh, plus, I suppose at this stage, uh, at my stage in life, I am, shall we say, getting uh, to the stage where I've been there, done that with farming for 43 years. So I am sort of anxious to step into the background. I certainly encourage other young farmers to perhaps go into partnership with their, with their parents at home. Um, it gives a lot of responsibility for the younger farmer and it's a great sort of interim stage before taking over the home farm. It gives them responsibilities, it allows them to make decisions and maybe make some mistakes before maybe taking over the whole farm fully. Uh, and I think the other aspect too is about making a partnership work is I think both parties need to want it to work. If you enter it for the sake of doing it, I don't think it'll work out so well, but both of us want it to work. I want it as a way out and he wants it as a way in, so it, it's going well for us.